Hey everyone, Sega Man Tony back here. This is a review video of the PSP Vita. My thoughts on it and what I think of it so far. I do have a few games too uh, that I played and thought were pretty good on it. But uh, there's going to be good parts and bad parts about this system. And I'm going to actually give it a grade after I'm done. And uh, the PSP Vita is it's a pretty good it's a pretty good handheld system. Um, the only thing, well, let's let's talk about the good things first. The good things about the PSP Vita is um, it actually has uh, has a lot of good things that you can do on it. You know, um, you know, side, you know, touching it, the screen. Uh, really nice vivid colors um, I'll say this part in the department of entertainment it's way better than a 3ds it just is it's it's way better than a 3ds when it comes to the entertainment department the only thing I think the 3ds can do that the PSV that can't is still do YouTube I think it doesn't support YouTube anymore but it does support Netflix uh, just like the 3DS. And I have this game for it. Mortal Kombat. This is a good game. Graphically, game gameplay, gameplay is, is very good on it. Um, the sound is a little off on it. Like it you, you can hear it, but in order to, when you're playing story mode of this game, of, Mor of Mortal Kombat, um, it's not, you can hear it now pretty good. But when you're playing in story mode, it's hard to hear sometime Luke Kang and Raiden, whoever's talking in it. But, um, yeah, it's, it's pretty good as far as graphically. Uh, the sticks are really good. They move very well. The buttons are very nice. There's a little bit of squeaking when you're when you're using some of the buttons, but um, as you can see there, it it's pretty good, you know. Now, uh, let me see. The downfall to the PSP is one of the things like I told you it was the sound on it. Uh, it it really sucks. Their memory sucks, you know. Um, you can't even you you can't even get you can go get a used memory card, but they're still expensive. I only got an eight gig because I don't think I'll be using it that much, you know. Certain there's only certain games I, I want for it. I'm not really into RPGs and you know role playing, and I'm not. I mean that's for some people like that. That's cool. But I'm not really into that, so I think it's I think it's more geared towards the Japanese fan base, the PSP Vita, uh, in my opinion. But uh, yeah, the memory sucks on this. I mean, 32 gig I think memory card for this is 80 bucks. Give me a break. I mean, I've seen a PSP Vita for a hundred dollars, and they want. 80 bucks for a 32 gig that's just that's unacceptable and even the used ones that go for like 50 and 40 dollars i think that's the real bad downfall is they stop making hardware you know hardware for it everything's becoming digital download on it you know um and even the titles you get now even used they're still expensive i guess because they're maybe they're sought after more because people was trying to get the physical copies of their games but um yeah, that's ridiculous. The memory thing is just totally ridiculous, and I believe that's one of its failures, is because they made the memory uh, cards for this so high. That's just that's just ridiculous. You know, they shouldn't be that high at all. With the 3DS, uh, you already get memory in there, so I mean, they got them beat in that department, and they also got them beat as far as having more titles and games and variety. You know, the 3DS is, is it's better, guys, hands down. When it comes to like having more games, period. Even even in the virtual console, even you know, even in you know regular having regular hardware, they do beat them. You know, um, I do think the 
3DS is to me still a better system because um, it has more games. You know, it might not be able to beat the the PS uh, the Vita so in graphics. It might be able to get up with it. It might not be able to beat it in gra in graphics, but it just has more games. You know, the, the handheld the handheld market is is dominated by Nintendo. So I mean, you know, but I'll, I give the I give the PS Vita. I give it, you know, my book. I'm going to give it a C. You know, I, I think it's I think it's if you're a collector, I think you should actually, you know, add it to your collection of video of uh, systems that you have uh, handheld systems. Um, I did get Mortal Kombat for it. Like I said, this is a really good game. I got it new. Uh, for twenty dollars, but I actually had a, a gift card. And also, what's cool about this is you get to play as Kratos um, from God of War. Now, I wasn't a big fan of God of War, but he he really kicks ass in uh, in this Mortal Kombat game. And another game you guys know, I like racing games, is I got his Knee for Smeet uh, Most Wanted. This game it's pretty cool. Um, you know, when you're driving the car, it's really uh, let me see, it's just really sensitive. So with turns and, and, and stuff like that, and sometimes you you crash a lot, but you have to get you got just have to get used to it the uh, driving mechanics of this game. But uh, it's a pretty good game for the the PS um, the PS Vita. Uh, I'm I am going to be having a video soon of some pickups that I'm getting. I'm just waiting for a few more in the mail. But yeah, that's my thoughts of the uh, PS Vita. I do give it a C. Um, it's just a shame that, you know, everything's going digital. But you know, a lot of people on YouTube even say in their videos they want they want hard copies of games. People are still not really ready for digital download, you know, for their video game systems, including myself. I would rather have that physical copy in my hand. You know, I don't want no digital. I want to know that I own it, that it's mine, and I can hold it. You know, and there's a lot of people on here that will see this video that will agree with me. But yeah, uh, I like the Vita. It's not my favorite handheld, but uh, hey, you know it's it's got a lot of you, you got a camera on it. Uh, you can surf the inter internet on it. It is better hands down when it comes to entertainment. You know, better than the 3DS. But the 3DS definitely got it beat when it comes to software and games. So Sega Man Tony out. I will be having another video soon. Happy New Year. Don't drink too much. Play games, don't drink too much, and have a good day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.